It's early morning, January 25th. I'm in Rockdale, Shadow's in the back of the truck, and we're headed to the site, and let's go see what's been going on. I hear, well, hold on, let me just show you. But before we head over to the site, let's just make our stop right here. Well, let's just make our stop at our local Starbucks here in Rockdale, Texas. All across America, you walk into these small stores. This happens to be Cafe Corner in Rockdale. Every single day I've walked in here for the last three years, and this is my local Starbucks. So I've made my way from Cafe Corner, you know, my local Starbucks, right into the site, and I am passing some things. I mean, I can't show you some of them because they're not done, but let's go to the first one. I just walked up to the inventory building. I've been talking about this for a while now, but on January 16th, I showed you where we were, what the progress was, and they had about half of the building left to do. Well, I can tell you today, this building is just about done. We have roll-up doors to do and electrical work to finish inside, but our team from H&K, they're knocking it out. I've also talked a lot about our office complex that's going in to get all of our team members in the same place. Well, this is just about done too. On the inside, they're doing all the preparation work, getting everything set up. I know our team, our administration side of the team is getting all the furniture ready to be delivered. We're getting electrical hooked up. Before you know it, we're gonna be one unified team in one single building. And honestly, I can't wait because we're spread out all over this facility. I'm on the north end of building E. These right behind me, here's E. We've been turning miners on there. We're gonna go in there in one second, but look, if you remember the expansion of the employee center, we hadn't even poured the concrete yet. And last week they poured the concrete and this building's going up is just as fast or faster than the inventory building. I'm also standing on an incredible amount of concrete that's poured. You can see it's rained a tremendous amount, but I'm standing high and dry. And before you know it, we'll have concrete driveways all the way to the other end, which will help us again, be more productive in our work. On the north end of building E, and if you remember, there's the door. We were 250 feet in, but I just pasted it off a second ago. Now there's only 150 feet left to go. And if I look, hold on, hold on, let me just show you. There is 40 megawatts already wired. You can see they're finishing the last poles, the switch gears in place, everything's going along. And that right there, that's the center of the building. Let's walk up there. I just walked past the center of the building and I can see they have 10 megawatt stage right here, but I just heard them over talking. Look, at me. they're doing the final testing in this section right here. And they say this 10 megawatts is going live today. I just pulled up to building D on the south side near the substation. And I got to show you. Our crews are starting to install our 20 foot evaporative cooling walls. And these walls will go all the way down the building to the very end on each side of both building D and building E. It's been such a, a awesome morning here in Rockdale. The sun is out now, the skies are blue, it's 40 degrees, but I tell you, there's nothing that beats the blue skies here in Rockdale. My name's Chad Harris, Riot's Rockdale facility, right here in the great state of Texas, and thank you for watching.